Dr. Tosan Erabo, Registrar, Medical Laboratory Council of Nigeria, MLSCN, says no COVID-19 rapid test kit is currently approved for use in Nigeria by the council. Erabo said this in Abuja while briefing journalists on the outcome of the second batch of pre-market validation of COVID-19 test kits recently carried by the agency. It is to be noted that the 22 rapid test kits in this report have not, I repeat, have not met the expected performance characteristics of sensitivity and specificity of to qualify them for deployment for the purpose of testing in disease surveillance and routine diagnosis in Nigeria. MLSCM encourages both local and other manufacturers to improve on the standardization of their products so as to meet the minimum validation requirements. In his remarks, Dr. Chikwe Ihekweazu, the Director General of NCDC, represented by Mr. Akin Pelu Afolabi, Lab Manager for National Reference Laboratory Abuja, appreciated the Council for not allowing Nigerians to use fake test kits. We need support of every one of us that are doing the testing in the country. Where do we need their support? We need support in the area where you need not to patronize illegal kits. Any kit that is not validated by MLSN is illegal kit in the country. And that is where we need to support them to make sure that we are really following the trend. National President of the Association of Medical Laboratory Scientists of Nigeria, AMLSN, Dr. Basi Basi, who was represented by Dr. Kasmir Ifeanyi, commended the MLSCN and NCDC for their efforts to fight COVID-19. We're happy with the number of kits that are already available, that are passed through this first batch and second batch of validation. They just need to tinker a little. I am particularly impressed with the specificity that we're getting. A little effort in working at the ability will give us what we're looking for. I am happy at the margin that is set here, the margin of error, and of course, the confidence interval. That is the minimum we must get. It must be 95, 95, 95, triple 95 for it to pass the test. 